Hey guys, welcome to Cook This, I'm Shireen. We're roasting a turkey today. So I'm getting all of my aromatics, which I'm gonna stuff it with an onion, lemon, and some garlic, and of course, lots of delicious fresh herbs. I don't like to put stuffing in my cavity. I like to fill it with all this delicious flavor because what happens is it seeps out into the jus, which is just the juices that sort of release from the turkey and makes an awesome gravy. Tie the wings close to the body. And the reason why we do this is that way everything cooks evenly. So I like to put the butter on first and then season it with salt and pepper. So just sort of slather the body. You just want to go around and give it a nice massage. Be sprinkled. And this is a big bird. You want it to penetrate in through the meat. It's going to make it so flavorful. So kosher salt. We already went into the cavity. Now all the way around. Turkey stock, chicken stock. So you just want to put that in the bottom of the pan. Then when I'm ready to brown it, I'll take off the foil. You want to baste her just a little bit. You want it nice and golden. You want it to register 160, 165 degrees. And then that way when it rests, it's going to continue to cook. My roux, I have my butter and my flour and I want to cook it out just a little bit just to cook out that raw flour flavor. In goes the wine. So this is what's going to make your gravy better than everybody else's. So my turkey has rested a good 30 minutes. I just lined my cutting board with a little bit of towels. That way, when the juices roll out, it's somewhere for it to go. Now I'm gonna to start to carve the turkey. So the first thing you wanna do is go in for the breast. Remove this breast in one piece. All right, take the tip of your knife and just gently, gently, we don't wanna shred the meat. We just wanna cut the meat and remove the breast bone. Cut it into slices. All right, you just want to come right in and you'll feel the natural separation of the bone. Pull it back. There it is, bone. Go in there. And again, that thigh has that beautiful skin. So we're going to cut it the same way we did the breast. All right, so now for everything else. This is good eats. You don't want to get rid of this. You could just place this right onto your serving platter. Happy Thanksgiving.